Good morning, everybody. Stetson with Stetson Lawn Care here. It's Tuesday morning, and we got, today is a big yard day. First yard of the day, the two acre property, mowing with the 36 also. Not gonna be recording here, because we recorded last week, so. Uh, so we're gonna get this done, and then I'll see you guys the next one, but check it out. Carlos is joining the hat, the fedora hat group. Wow, you wish you had this. I do. I'm about to go get one of those today, guys. A sombrero. You're mad. <laughs> I am. <laughs> All right. Guys, we will see you in about two uh, an hour and a half for us, but one second for you. Oh, okay, guys. So we're at the next yard. Um, we mowed this last week, but it's, it's, by, it's weekly now, so she's ready to be mowed. I'll go ahead and record this. Why not? Nice green yard, one of my favorite ones to mow. And the right stripes it pretty good too, so. We're gonna get her done, and then we're gonna head to the next ones, but. Carlos, you having a good day so far? Great day. A great day, that's good, that's awesome. We just finished up this yard over here. Carlos is blowing off. Uh, but guys, I got a, I have a question for you. Here, let me get over here. What do you guys prefer to use for like sweat rags and stuff? Cause you know, I use this bandana that I have, but it doesn't work that well as a sweat rag. So I need to know, I mean, what are you guys using? Uh, I've, I've tried those. You know the rags where you snap them and they get colder, you put water on them? I've tried those before, those worked, those worked out pretty good, but I lost it, so I don't know where it went. So I've thought about going back to that, but what do you guys use for this year's sweat rags? Uh, I'm looking to get some uh, some new one, a new one. So, yeah guys, well Carlos is blowing off. Just wanted to ask you what you guys prefer. Oh, jeez man. I just, I pulled my back, I pulled my back like a month ago. I just did it again at the last yard and Back's a little, it's a little tender now, just right above, right under my shoulder blade. So, gonna have to try to not hurt myself. <laughs> but, guys, we got next one is a corner lot. You guys have never seen them before, actually. So we're gonna head there, and I'll probably record it. So we will see you when we get there. All right, guys, we just pulled up to the next yard. This is, uh, it's a client of mine's father-in-law, I believe, and. So uh, he just wants me to mow it one time for him. So I said, all right, bet, I will do that. There's really nothing in the backyard, but I'm just gonna record the front part and maybe over here. So I'm gonna use the right and uh, get her done. Carlos, I like your hat, man. Dude, thank you. He he hecho in Mexico. You said that way. Say it, how, you, how are you supposed to say it? Hecho in Mexico. Hecho in Mexico. Hecho in Mexico. Okay, gotcha. See guys, I'm not very fluent in Spanish.
What's up guys? So we finished the one over there. Now we're at the next one in my neighborhood, which is, you guys have all seen it. Maybe not you newer people, but the OG subscribers from last season have seen it. Uh, but we're gonna, I'm not gonna record the front, but I guess I'll go ahead and record the back. See you after. Alright guys, unexpected sequence in the video. We're heading to my dealer real quick and we're gonna pick up a new piece of equipment. So you guys might know what it is, you might not, but I've told you that I'm gonna get this, so we're gonna head there right now. Well guys, we are back home from my dealer and we have a new piece of equipment. There's a hint that you're seeing right now and I'm not sure if you can notice, but I'm about to show you right here. Here it is guys. So we picked up the steel BR800C with the sides, the one with the side start. I ended up loving the demo. I liked it way better than the Echo. It's way smoother, quieter. I feel like, I felt like it was more powerful. That was just me, man. I liked it. So I decided to go with it. And now on the trailer guys, we got a BR800 and a, an Echo PB770. This one we just bought might be getting sold pretty soon to replace it with another BR800. Not sure, but I just know that I liked the BR800 way better. So guys, we did pick this up. That's awesome, man. The hint I was given was the hat right here, of course. <laughs> but I'm so happy. I can't wait to put this thing to use. It's gonna be gonna be a great blower for sure. So I think I'm gonna take off the the stomach buckle right here that goes around your stomach. So I don't really need that. So I'm gonna do that real quick. But before we end this video, I need to talk to you guys real quick. So first off, I wanna know what do you guys use for your uh, cleaning your deck, like a deck scraping tool? I have I have an actual tool, but I'm I'm wondering what you guys use and what you would recommend because the tool I have doesn't really work the best. So I mean, I've used a flathead screwdriver in the past, but I, I wanna know, I'm curious to what you guys use. So let me know in the comments. That's the first thing. Second thing is I wanna give a huge shout out to my wolf pack. Nick from Saving Green Lawn Care, the creator of the Wolfpack Man. Nick is the coolest guy I've ever met. Dude, he's amazing. You guys, if you haven't checked out his channel, Saving Green Lawn Care, I'm sure most of you guys have. Most of you guys are probably from his channel that came to me. But guys, I cannot express everything that Nick has done for me business-wise, YouTube-wise. He's helped me so much, man, in my business especially. And I'm, I'm forever grateful for that. I, there's no way that I can repay him for all everything that he's helped me with. So Nick, thank you for all your time, dude. Next is Shane. You guys all know Shane, DLT Lawn Care, man. Go subscribe to him. He's almost at a thousand subs, guys. He's like, I think he's at 940, maybe something like that, 950. He's almost there. So you guys watching this, you should go sub to him, help him out, get to 1K. He's doing a giveaway at 1,000, actually. He's giving away a, uh, 
I believe it's a hundred dollar gift card to somewhere or maybe just a hundred dollar visa card I don't know but I know that that's what he's doing at a thousand subs similar to what I did I gave away two fifty dollar Home Depot Home Depot gift cards so guys go check out Shane DLT lawn care and then of course we got Eric from Cattle lawn care guys Eric is actually a fellow Okie I'm from Oklahoma I'm in OKC he's down in Altus about a two-hour drive <clears throat> but his wife actually does Arbon with my girlfriend and my mom and so they once a month Arbon has like a meeting in the city and so he uh and back in I think it was April he, they drove up here I hung out with Eric while his wife went to the meeting and it was so fun man oh but guys cattle lawn care go check them out of course everybody in the wolf pack I'll put it on screen again we got saving green lawn care cattle lawn care DLT lawn care baby all those guys are so loyal man hard-working individuals yes guys I'm so happy about the steel so happy about the wolf pack man if you are wondering how to get in the wolf pack and the benefits of it Nick has a video that he did on I believe it was last Friday or maybe Saturday this past weekend so if you guys are curious go check out his video so yeah guys I hope you enjoyed this video as much as I did getting to purchase the new steel I'm so excited to use it it's gonna be a great addition to the Stets Lawn Care family and then up next a new mower you guys probably know what it is but I'm not gonna say it so yeah hope you guys enjoyed this video I will not have a video tomorrow have a video on Thursday so see you guys then peace out